Princess Anne has taken on a new role previously held by her beloved father Prince Philip, it has been announced. The Princess Royal has signaled she has no intention of slowing down as she approaches her 72nd birthday. Rather, Anne has recently agreed to become the patron of an association previously supported by her father, the late Duke of Edinburgh. The organization, BAPRA's British Association of Plastic Reconstructive and Aesthetic Surgeons aims to raise awareness of the breadth of plastic surgery as well as promote innovation in the field and understanding of the profession. Upon sharing the news, the association said in a statement, BAPRA's is delighted to announce that Her Royal Highness, the Princess Royal has agreed to become its royal patron. HRH Princess Anne is regarded as one of the hardest working members of the royal family and with her support for the military services we felt she would have a connection with the work and origins of our association. The statement added a touching tribute to Prince Philip, who died in April last year. It read, for the last 57 years, until his sad passing in 2021, we have benefited from the patronage of the His Royal Highness the Duke of Edinburgh who has been an inspirational figure and vocal supporter of the association. Over the course of his life, the late Duke became associated with more than 990 charities and associations. Some of these patronages were passed on to other members of the firm, such as the British Trust for Ornithology, which is now spearheaded by the Duke of Cambridge. However, many others lost their links to the royal family after the passing of the Queen's husband. The announcement concerning Anne's new patronage was hugely welcomed by royal fans, with some taking to Twitter to praise the royal and her dedication to duty. Writing on Twitter, Lady Anna had said, I wish she could be the next queen. She rocks. Another Twitter user, Carol, said, Excellent news, she'll be a wonderful patron, congratulations. Moreover, Avenue wrote, Congratulations. This will be a great partnership finally, Twitter user Iswiz said, Brilliant, she will do you proud. As noted by Bapras, Princess Anne has established herself over the years as one of the hardest working members of her family, often carrying out the highest number of engagements and official visits in a year when compared to her relatives. Anne holds more than 300 organizations focused on a range of topics including farming, sciences, and mental and physical health support. One of her most known patronages is Save the Children, with whom she has been associated for more than 50 years. Princess Anne is also a supporter of the armed forces and holds several honorary military titles, including Admiral in the Royal Navy, General in the British Army and Air Chief Marshal of the Royal Air Force. As Colonel of the Blues and Royals, the Queen's daughter joined Prince William and Prince Charles, Colonels of the Irish Guards and Welsh Guards respectively, during the Trooping the Colour Parade last month, to take the salute on behalf of the Sovereign. Princess Anne is loved by many royal fans for her no-nonsense and down-to-earth approach. She last showcased it when she traveled for work to Australia and Papua New Guinea alongside her husband Sir Timothy Lawrence in April.